All right, you guys, here's the view while I'm recording this. <laughs> it's not much of a view, is it? Well, it is. It's a great view, but you probably can't see much. It's, um, <clears throat> it's 11 o'clock at night right now on um, Tuesday night. It's probably too dark out here. Hey, let's go in. I <sighs> just want to catch you guys up because um, as usual, I haven't been around much. Still trying to get this Flab Labs thing go up and going um, that I talked about in my last post, but um, I thought it was worth giving you guys a little update about what's going on um, with the computer. <laughs> Are you sick of hearing about this yet? I am sick of talking about it. Anyway, I told you guys that um, HP saw me tweeting and they um, got a hold of me and asked me if they could make it right and they sent me a new computer and I did get the new computer last week. Uh, it arrived on Friday and um, immediately started up and loaded in Firefox and loaded up a couple of videos to see if they played right and um, I didn't get a chance to notice if the, the, the video played right because the speakers were so crackly I couldn't stand it. You guys, did I kill a small village of innocent computers in my past life? <laughs> or what? Because my computer karma is truly screwed up. <laughs> so anyway, so something wrong with the speakers or the audio drivers or something. So I was going to get a friend to help me out. Um, and we logged on using the, um, we tried to log on using the um, remote assistance thing because he doesn't live in the city. So he's going to give me a hand. And um, we couldn't get the remote assistance to work either. It's a brand new computer. As far as I can tell, it's top of the line supposed to be a really nice computer. Anyway, he gave me a few instructions of things to look around at and uh, we just we couldn't find the audio drivers in this stupid thing at all. <laughs> it's got to have some in there somewhere because it makes noises, but um, they're not where they're supposed to be. So he said something's totally whack. So I let HP know that something was going on and she said, all right, let's send a tech your way. So I'm going to have to have that lovely gentleman over for tea again so he can take a look at my computer and we can visit and catch up on each other's lives. <laughs> you know? I mean, it's got to end sooner or later, right? I mean, it can't go on forever, right? Right? <laughs> so my emotional well-being is not, um, is not doing fabulously right now because I'm just pissed off beyond all, beyond all description, really. Uh, otherwise, yeah, I've still been managing to get out for my stress relief because, good Lord, do I ever need it right now. Uh, I had a really good workout today. I actually, um, I've been finding myself getting a little bit lackadaisical during my workouts. I get kind of, I've been getting complacent and finding myself kind of dawdling between sets and going over to look at Twitter and, oh, email just beep, better look at that. And today, um, Brad, who's I'm working with, was waiting for me to get on something for him. So, um, uh, work on something for him. So I felt pressure to just get through my workout and um, get on with it. And I uh, actually had a really good workout because I didn't dawdle. So I got to stop that. I got to stop dawdling because I really did actually have a, a much better workout today knowing it was pressure to hurry up and get on with it. Um, so, you know, a little lesson for me to keep my mind on my on what I'm doing and maybe I'll turn off the speakers on my computer from now on uh, when I'm working out because it really is a big distraction for anybody working out at home, I think. <clears throat> so, you know, you think you have no distractions at home. <laughs> maybe you have more. <laughs> I don't know. And uh, yesterday I went and ran hills, which was great. Uh, I haven't ran, ran hills in a long time, and it felt really, really good just to get my yayas out. And the cardio before that, I actually did some interval stuff. Um, not, not my hill sprints, but just straight, flat interval, 30 seconds sprinting, 30 seconds walking, 30 seconds sprinting, 30 seconds walking uh, for 40 minutes in total. And I, I didn't think I would make it all the way to um, my usual turnaround point because I haven't done them much this summer because it's been a really hot summer. And so I've just been doing stuff that, I, that isn't so hard. <laughs> My bad. Um, just because it has been so hot that even a straight run was fine. I found it to be very difficult. Anyway, I made it to my turnaround point, so I was really surprised by that. Um, so I guess I'm not, didn't let myself get too out of shape over summer. <laughs> I, didn't, I don't think I got out of shape over summer. I think I just got a little, little bit lazy on the intensity part of my workouts. Um, but now that excuse is done because it's cooled off quite considerably in Vancouver. So I'll be cranking that up again pretty, pretty, uh, pretty well right away. Uh, you know, even the last couple of workouts even were, were good. So that's what I've been up to you guys. So um, I don't know when I'll hear from HP again. She's not the quickest with the emails back. It usually takes a day. But, um, you know, wish me luck. It's got to end eventually, right? It can't go on forever. <laughs> 
<laughs> the warranty will expire in three years and it's got to stop. <laughs> anyway, you guys, I hope you're having a great night. By the time you see this, it'll be tomorrow morning. It'll be Wednesday. So um, we're having a great hump day and a uh, great rest of the week. And we'll see you again very soon. Take care. Bye.